Hello everyone, this is Trish with Bird Feed and I have another haul for you guys. Yes, another haul and this is a big one, it's huge. Um, today is the first day of Walgreens 70% off Christmas clearance. They're regular Christmas items and the toys that they got in for Christmas. Um, and I want to give a big shout out. Thank you to Emily from Love in a Shoebox for um, giving us a heads up to that yesterday in her video. Um, so anyway, I got a lot of stuff and let's get to it. I f and I, uh, I went to three different Walgreens to get these because not all of them have the same things. Um, I found these three Paw Patrol guys and girls at one of three Walgreens that I went to. Um, they only had these three, and I got all three of them. There's Rocky, and they talk. And Sky. And Marshall. Oh, he didn't say. Oh, you know what? I think they might say something different each time because it seems like he said something different before. But those, I don't know what they were regularly priced, but those were only 74 cents. That's why I got all three of them because I only had Marshall in my hand. And when, she, when it rang up 74 cents, I said, hold on a minute. And I ran and got the other two. And then I found... Also, in only one of the three uh, Walgreens that I went to, I found these left. I had seen them when they were regular priced, um, but I didn't see them even when they went to 50 off except one Walgreens. Actually, you know what? I went to four Walgreens today. Yeah, I wound up going to a Walgreens I hadn't planned on going to. It's just I was continuing my errands while I was out and I was near one that I've never been to before and that's where I found these. Um, I got, there were three, well there were, I don't know, probably six different kinds. I picked up, um, these are the Fisher Price Little People Disney Princesses. This is Cinderella in her pumpkin chariot and then we have Ariel the mermaid, and this swings back and forth. And of course the little people come out. And the little car's wheel. Um, these were regularly $6.99 and they were on clearance for $2.10. This is um, Sleeping Beauty. She's sleeping in her bed, canopy bed, with a rose, waiting for her prince to give her a kiss and wake her up. So those were $2.10. I picked up a couple of transformers. I only saw these small transformers at one of the four stores. Um, there were three different kinds. I picked up Bumblebee, who turns into a car. These are the small um, transformers. I have some big ones, too. And um, this one's Grimlock, who turns into a dinosaur of some sort, I guess. And then the third one, I don't know his name, but he turned into a tank, like an army tank. So I did not get that one. And those were regularly $6.99 for $2.10. I picked up uh, a plush, bendable Spider-Man. Um, Emily from Love in a Shoebox showed this on her video yesterday. She got one, and he can sit and... This one, I didn't do my best job picking out a good one, though, because um, you have to mess with him to get him to stand well. Um, also, Emily had one of these. Uh, I don't know if she had Mickey or Minnie, but I picked up Minnie because I'm doing a mini box. But I don't think I'm going to be able to fit this in there. Uh, the plush I'm putting in there is actually pretty, pretty big. And these are so soft. I wish you could feel these. I'd love to have a blanket made out of this. But, um, yeah, 
the din, uh, the uh, Ninny Lovey. So she was two dollars and ten cents. And if I didn't say so, um, Spider Man was two two dollars and ten cents. Now I am doing a shoebox that is in need of a tea set, but I already have one, and I wasn't going to get this. But I saw it in like all three stores, all three Walgreens that I was originally going to. And I had already scoped them out as the three Walgreens to go to first because they had the biggest amount of inventory. Uh, so I was there like two days ago. And all three of them had this tea set but none of them had it today. But when I went to that last, the fourth Walgreens that I wasn't planning on going to, that was, you know, on, on my uh, trek uh, running my errands, I came across, uh, they had like three or four of them, so I picked one up. But, um, yeah, I couldn't pass this up. And I want, I want to say someone had this in their shoebox last year, so they must have gotten it at Walgreens last year. I want to say it was Sharon from East Coast Stories. Um, but yeah, so that was $2.10. Then I picked up um, another pack of friction cars. These are the friction cars that I didn't get, if you saw my last haul from Walgreens at 50% off, I bought the Marvel friction cars, it had three in a pack, so they were a little bit different. And I passed this one up, but at 210, I went ahead and picked it up. So these were $2.10. Marvel, uh, the, uh, well, they're Marvel too, but the Spider-Man friction cars. Then I picked up some, another pony set. I had these in several of my boxes last year. I wasn't going to pick any up. But this year they put a little, they made them unicorns. And they're great colors. You know, the turquoise and the orange, I just thought that was so cool. Pink and purple and yellow and turquoise. I mean, they're just really cute. And uh, I will probably break these up. Uh, last year I... I Left them as a family, but um, and made it the wow item. But uh, this year, I will probably break them up and just put them in in boxes. Um, I picked up a lot of stuff here, you guys, and some of it, you know, some of it's going to go in my shoe boxes this year. Some of it will go in my giving storage uh, for a future time. Some of it is going to go in a filler box for this, for 2021. And some of it is going to go to my grandkids. And some of it may go to like a Toys for Tots kind of thing next year. Because I got a lot of stuff. But I thought, you know, $2.10. When am I going to have a chance to get toys that cheap? Um, so I, I've got a stash of toys for whatever, whatever we need it for. Um, I picked up a, a tub of stickers. It's a thousand stickers and, uh, the, the tub is great in and of itself. And these are some of the stickers that come in it. And this was $6.99 regularly for $2.10. So that's, you know, some of the stickers you get in it. Can see those, but those are some of the stickers. Two dollars and ten cents. So we got those too. Then I picked up two more of these Hexbug Vex Robotics um, building sets. I had picked up the Orbital Shuttle when I did the fifty percent off haul, and. Um, I do. I I really love doing the uh, outer space themes, and these are great for boys, whether you do an outer space theme or, or not. Um, it doesn't take up a lot of space, 
um, in the box, these the packages are a lot smaller than you would think from looking at the box. Oh, I was going to pull out the... Uh, so, you know, like, this is it, and you can just pierce this to get the air out of it. So it, it can be pretty small. And then I did want to show you these um, instructions, but the ones, uh, the instructions in the orbital shuttle that I bought were not in the package. They were actually separate in the box, but I, I wanted to show you that they are um, totally illustrated. There's no words on it. It's just numbered step one and step two with uh, the pictures of, of each step that you take to put them together. And this is for ages six and up. So this one's an aerial drone. The first one I got at 50% off was a, sh a shuttle, the orbital shuttle. This one's an aerial drone. This one is a rover. I just think they're really cool. I think boys uh, from 5 to 14 would like those. Then I picked these up. Again, it's something that I wasn't going to grab, but I did. For $2.10, you can't not. Um, these are, you put sets that you snap these things together. This one is a fire, a flame jumper. And I want to say, I don't know what they do to make this flame, but it seems like I saw a picture somewhere. Oh, here it is. The flame is like fake. You know, obviously it's, it's fake. We want it to be fake, but, um, you uh, press on a lever and it shoots the car through the hoop of flames. And it comes with a car, a flame jump jumper car. That was $2.10. And then I picked this one up. This one, again, see if you see this lever, you push down on the lever and it, it does a loop-de-loop -loop and it shoots the car out that way. And it comes with a car. So $2.10 for the Hot Wheels. Then I picked up, um, if you remember, in my 50% off Walgreens haul, which I didn't get a lot of things at that time. I just picked up a couple of things. And um, I had mentioned that they had Marshall, which I couldn't remember his name, but his name is Marshall, the fire dog. Um, so I picked up the play mat with Marshall in his car. And that was $2.10. And I also picked up Peppa Pig. I probably will not do anything with Peppa Pig this year. Well, I shouldn't say that. I may change my, my mind. But um, I picked her up because, just because she was there. And several of the stores had quite a few of these play mats left. Um, day before yesterday. But today they didn't have a lot. They had a few. Um, and I thought, you know, if I wanted it, you know, I thought about waiting to these things were 80% off because that last year I picked up everything at 80% off, but last year I didn't know about Walgreens per se and their toys sale after Christmas until it was 80% off. And, um, you know, I got a few things. But there was nothing, no selection like there was, you know, this year. So I didn't want to wait. Now this I didn't pick up for my shoe boxes. This is charades for kids. I picked these up for my grand, grandkids. It's really cute. You know, they have a picture of what you're supposed to act out. And um, I know my two grandsons are going to love this. They're going to get a kick out of it. And it's for ages four and up, I think. I saw that somewhere. Yeah, four and up. So I picked up charades for kids. So some of these things are probably going to stay at my house. Um, the things that I uh, or am going to give to my grandkids because I just, you know, I have, I have the basement set up for them. It's a whole big playroom down there and um, that's when they come that's their dart for the door and go downstairs um, I found these journals now I only found a few of these um, 
I found the owl in one store. There were two. And it's so soft and furry like a plush, but it is a journal. And that was $2.10. And then in another store, I found, and they had two, this, um, oops, mermaid or unicorn or unimermaid. <laughs> I don't know what you would call her. And then her pages are like this. So those were really cute for $2.10. I love those. And then uh, one of the free stores that I originally scoped out day before yesterday had about eight of these. But today, and this I went to this one first thing in the morning. This morning was probably about, well, it's probably about 8.45. So they'd probably been open for 45 minutes. Um, but they only had three left. Uh, I wanted Hulk. Hulk was gone. But they had two Black Panther and one um, Captain America. And I picked those up for $2.10 each. So I've got those. And that, like I said, those were, were only in one, one of the stores. Then I picked up two of these. Um, Jessica from Foothills Family had picked these up. Um, oh, she did a haul several days ago and, and showed these. And I picked them up for $2.10 each. Then I picked up this five wood puzzles, Paw Patrol. Um, again, I saw somebody put this in their uh, shoebox last year. Yeah, 2020. And um, I don't know if they got it at Walgreens. Well, they might have gotten it at Wal Walgreens. But uh, no, 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 no. It was Emily at Love in a Shoebox, and she got it at Five Below. I don't know if it was Paw Patrol, but it was a similar type of set where you get five puzzles. Uh, one is 24 pieces, uh, two are 16 pieces, and then two are eight pieces. But they're wood, so I really like that, and this can be divided up into several uh, shoeboxes. So this was $2.10. And then we go to the expensive items. <laughs> These were um, originally $9.99 and um, had two stores, had two of these. Only one had Bell. And I picked this up because I'm doing a Bell shoe box. Now I'm hoping I'm going to be able to fit this in. It's quite big. I did see Christy M. haul this last year. I never really saw her put it in a shoebox, though, I don't, I don't think. Maybe it was just too big, um, but I had to have her. This was uh, on clearance for $2.99. The $9.99 price point. Uh, they went to $2.99. So I picked up Bell. Um, they had Jasmine from Aladdin. And they had someone else. I forget. I forget who it was. I picked these up. I did a couple of farm themes. They're on the farm themes last year. And I had so much fun doing them. I, I love doing that. Uh, for this age range and I, I wasn't going to do one this year but I guess I am now I picked up these hand puppets they were regularly $9.99 for $2.99 got a lamb, a pig, a cow and a horse so we've got those and this I, I, actually I could split this up to two boxes so I got those then I picked up uh, I am doing a fire truck theme or fireman theme uh, this year and don't really need the other two trucks offhand, but I'm sure I will eventually use them for something 
or put them in those filler boxes. But the recycle truck is a friction powered truck. And then the uh, fire truck and the helicopter have lights and sounds. And these were regularly $9.99 for $2.99. So then, all right, already. <laughs> It's not going to stop. I was going to say maybe it's stuck. Then I picked up three of the original real big size Transformers. Um, I wanted so bad to do a Transformers box last year, and I could, didn't come across a deal on Transformers. But now I did. So these were $2.99. I picked up three. Uh, Bumblebee. And two of these are going in the basement for my grandkids. One will go in a shoebox. Uh, Bumblebee turns into a car. And Optimus Prime turns into a uh, semi-truck. And then uh, Starscream turns into a jet. So... Is that everything? Yeah, you guys, that's my haul. And um, I hope you enjoyed it. <laughs> it's a lot of stuff here. But I figured, you know, what the hey, two bucks a piece. I mean, I got 39 items and even with the more expensive ones and the cheaper ones, it they averaged out to like 212 an item. And um, I also had like $15 in uh, rewards money to use, which had shaved, shaved the price down a little bit as well. So, um, anyway, that's it. I, I hope you're able to get out and, uh, check out your Walgreens. And, um, also I found these in different places in the store. Some Walgreens had the Christmas clearance toys up in that, that main aisle where they put the seasonal goods, which is now uh, across from where they're putting out Valentine's stuff. And some of them still had uh, or had put the toys back in toys. So there, when you go down the aisle, like the left side would be the clearance toys and the right side would be their regular price toys. So I found them that way. This I found in the regular price toys but I knew it was supposed to be on clearance because I saw it on clearance on another store. But that didn't work on a couple of other things that I found the same way. So I, some stores may not have marked certain things down. But um, for the most part, you know, it was easy enough to find. But um, yeah, so don't not walk to the back where they have toys because you'll probably find some back there. And uh, if you have an opportunity to go to more than one Walgreens, try it if you're looking for something in, uh, in particular. So um, thanks for watching. And uh, if you like the video, give it a thumbs up and um, come back and tell me uh, what you got. I'd love to hear um, what you found at Walgreens. See you next time. Bye now.